Here at Point Defiant Zoo and Aquarium, the twinkle of some 800,000 lights illuminates the night. This is an annual South Sound holiday tradition, Zoo Lights. Zoo Lights is a wintertime light experience. It's all outdoors. There are animals and famous landmarks from the area, all created in lights, and they're all created by our team here at the zoo. Now in its 36th year, Zoo Lights runs from 4.30 to 10 p.m. through New Year's Day. Tickets must be purchased in advance online, both to ensure parking is smooth and so families have plenty of time to enjoy all the stunning displays. It's time spent together. It's a safe, quiet activity. You get to just enjoy the beauty of the season. While most of the zoo's resident animals are asleep during the evening hours, visitors can sign up for a private holiday-themed experience, Groovy Goats. That's it? Now they know. Yes, Point Defiance is home to a herd of 11 very friendly Nigerian dwarf goats. During the program, you get to groom them. Very low key, <laughs> these guys. This is very, this is very they, cathartic. It is, and it's really good for them too. It's fun for us. Sure. Um, but for our goats, this contact, goats are, these are goats that were bred to live with humans. And they tend to seek out human contact. Um, they tend to come and let us know that they want pets, that they want brushes. We buddies? You are now. The goat's diet consists mostly of hay pellets. To add some variety, during zoo lights, they get a seasonally appropriate peppermint-scented version. <laughs> I have to say, this is the first time I've ever made uh, festive holiday goat treats. You've never made peppermint grass before? I have not, but <laughs> you know what? They're into it. They which... are so into it. <laughs> everyone eats. Everyone eats. Hi, Bubba. Admission to Zoo Lights is included with groovy goats, so you can go right from hanging with the goats to exploring the incredible displays created by Zoo Lights coordinator Sam Porterfield and her team. Sam, when do you start putting up the lights for Zoo Lights? We start putting the lights up October 1st. Uh, <laughs> planning for that starts you know, a few months before that. Why do you do it? Why do you love doing it? Uh, for the people. Everybody loves to come out and see it. My grandkids love to hang out here. It's the best place to go. Each year of Zoo Lights is distinct with new additions like these gorgeous shadow boxes and classic displays. Visitors can hunt for Sasquatch who changes locations each year or visit the Flame Tree, which has been a centerpiece of the event since year two. The Flame Tree's been here for 35 years first year was the uh, second year of Zoo Lights, so this year we put 35,000 lights on it in recognition of that. A lot of people will tell us they use this for their Christmas card every year. They'll take a family picture in front of the tree. Yes, for so many, the festive season wouldn't be complete without a visit to Zoo Lights. It's one of those events where memories are made and one can't help but feel a little holiday magic. Zoo Lights is a celebration of the animals and the places and the things that make us a wonderful community. So we just really love to welcome families and friends here to celebrate the season and enjoy being together in a beautiful space.